Looking for me to let's go Take me on this journey home I don't wanna wait no All right, y'all, Spencer has confronted his stuck point in Coop and confessed his love for Olivia. But my question is, will Spencer's arm stop going numb? Y'all, this question has literally just been swirling around in the back of my mind, living rent-free, because as we exit episode eight, we entered into hiatus and prepare for episode nine, we don't necessarily get any kind of clear indication that Spencer is now healed mentally because he has confronted his stuck point with Coop and confessed his love for Olivia. Shout out to all of y'all that said that Olivia was also his stuck point. I definitely want to see him back in the chair and talking to Dr. Spears so that we can get a little bit more insight into that because I definitely can see how she could be an additional stuck point especially after we learned how he confessed his love to her and she ran out on him we could completely understand how after that he was navigating a very depressed and broken mental state which could also have manifested with his arm going numb i'm asking the question of will spencer's arm stop going numb because we saw that after he confronted coop he still was experiencing it and we haven't really seen him on the field aside from like the little pickup thing that he did with Jabari after the whole cabin trip and once we learned about him confessing his love and then having to deal with you know coming clean to Layla and all of that now y'all I'm not a gambling woman but if I had to place my bet I would place my bet on the side of a uh, Spencer's arm is not going to stop going numb anytime soon. I think that what he has going on psychologically is bigger than his resentment of Coop of putting him in the position to get shot and also bigger than the abandonment and hurt that he felt after being walked out on for confessing his love with Olivia. It's even bigger than the hope and love and joy that he felt in Olivia confessing her love back. I think that Spencer is going to be plagued for a little bit behind the decisions that he's made in the most recent months in particular how he has hurt Layla I think that him and Coop not being in a great place or not speaking anymore is going to bother him and because of that we aren't necessarily going to see a Spencer at peace which means we aren't going to see him making any kind of traction in reference to healing within his arm in addition to that he has the additional pressure on his back of the football team is not doing well he returned to Crenshaw in the hopes of turning the team around and that ain't going according to plan even though there's a little bit of hopes when he recruits Jabari to join the team and help out on the defensive end but that still definitely has a long way to go and he's also still battling with the pressure of if he can return to being the Spencer James that he used to be the top 54th player in the nation he is still on hold for his scholarship with UCLA so there's just so much pressure on Spencer's shoulders right now to be who he used to be or better to be happy to be able to navigate some of the silly decisions that he's made recently and I think that all of this is going to come together to work against him we're not going to see him get through these whole arm numbness issues anytime soon in addition to now we're adding onto the plate he wants to be with Olivia Olivia wants to be with him and they decide that they're going to go for it throw caution to the wind and figure it all out and then they get into this car crash and then he finds out that Olivia has been drinking so now this is one other thing that we know our boy Spencer who gotta save everybody he is going to tack this on his jacket and make this his responsibility he's going to try to get Olivia clean he's going to be very much so worried about her as we see in the preview trailer which the trailer is only seven seconds y'all for episode nine I'm waiting for them to drop a new trailer for the rest of season three because we need some content but in the episode nine preview trailer we see him yelling into the phone and i believe he's talking to olivia saying that she needs to get help and this is going to stress your boy 
So in addition to all of the things that I have already mentioned, now we're going to add Olivia's drinking and Spencer finding out about it onto there. Sir ain't going to have no peace. You know how, you know, they say that the guys say that the girl is supposed to be his peace. Olivia is not about to be Spencer's peace no time soon. So again, I don't think that Spencer's arm is going to stop going numb. I think that this is a complicated issue that is intertwined with his mental state. And until he gets to a peaceful and happy mental place, he is going to struggle with his arm. But now it's your turn. I want you to tell me in the comment section down below, do you think that Spencer's arm will stop going numb? If you don't think it will stop, then what do you think is the number one cause for why he's still struggling with it? And do you think Olivia has anything to do with it? Tell me all that and more in the comment section down below. And if you made it this far in the video, I appreciate you for watching the whole thing. Go ahead and give me four thunderbolts in your comment as well so that I can show you some extra love because you you are a real one who watched the whole video and I want to give you that love, that real love right back. I'm your girl Erica Vane and if you're new here, I post new All-American videos every day, sometimes twice a day and you should really hit the subscribe button and join the tribe. I promise you're going to love it here. We have the best All-American commentary community on the internet yeah i said it i said what i said jump in the comment section and you'll see exactly what i'm talking about but go ahead and subscribe so that you do not miss a video or an upload from me if you need to catch up on any of my all american videos i have my all about all american playlist tag right here and you should really be watching snowfall if you love all american it's a little bit grittier got a little bit more danger to it but it's still an amazing show as well and we talk about that on this channel as well so you can check out my snowfall breakdowns right here until my next upload or tomorrow in the next amazing all-american video i love you bye